so I need to be doing my bullet journal video, but um, I'm being lazy and I don't want to do it yet. So we're going to go through a semester's worth of sketches from a BFA major. It's from my sophomore year, spring semester. It's pretty much, I think, January through February, so I wanted to do a video of this after my semester was over, but I just got home a couple weeks ago. It's been about a month since I moved out, and I've just been busy getting home and getting settled living back home, so I haven't been filming a lot. I wanted to do a flip through of all the sketches and notes I did throughout the semester in this particular journal. Um, this was from Blick, but the cover fell off, so recovered it with a like suede type of fabric. So let's get started. So some of the first sketches I had, I have on my uh, what's it called? Some of these first sketches, they're on my. Redbubble account. So some of these that I did, um, I was looking for to do for Valentine's Day, so some of them ended up on my Redbubble account. There's some I really want to do still that I really like for stickers, um, doing with sexual liberty and expression and um, all that stuff, so I definitely will still want to do some that are in this sketchbook. I took a lot of notes in this sketchbook just because I like not having lines, so lots of notes from my classes in here. Here's some sick dog photos. I did this when I was sick, so... I was just thinking about being as sick as a dog. Um, I don't know. I think it would still be a cute idea to do like dog, little dog, sick dog photos. This is what I did in class. Really, really like this. Um, I did a bigger version of this on my big sketchbook paper, which I'll put a photo of here. But really like how this turned out. I did it where I took a reference from a famous painting. I don't remember which one I did off the top of my head, but there was peaches in there. I thought it was kind of fun. love this. I really hope I don't get demonetized for this sketch, but it's just all femininity and female sexuality and embracing your curves and your body and loving who you are. Love this sketch. I think it's beautiful. Love it so much. Um, architecture, it's not my favorite thing to draw in the world, but um, we had to learn it. It's part of the curriculum for the drawing class I was in, so we um, really got to play with some architecture stuff with drawing, so that was kind of interesting. sketch for a class that I did. I did it with um, watercolor, pencil, and some pens, I think, so pretty cool look, look at the sketch, I think. Not my best work, because I pretty much covered up all the building with trees, but, you know, I learned. Um, this was a sketch for another drawing I had to do for a class. This was the first sketch I did out of two or three, I think. A lot of notes in this. Um, this was a sketch for um, a project that we did for a group project. Picture here again. So this is for a group project. Um, pretty cool. 
this was the second sketch I did of um this was the second sketch I did of this one. So this was the first sketch, this was the second sketch. I really love how this turned out. I think it's actually really cool how it looks, and I think it's actually like a really good interior um drawing. I just really like how it turned out. Um which is weird because I'm not just I'm not someone who really likes drawing interiors, but this was just kind of like a really good challenge. So um I actually really enjoyed painting and drawing this. Um definitely would be better on uh, painting paper or like mixed media paper instead of drawing paper, but you know, you live when you learn. Characters, oh my gosh. I have to like blur some of this out, but <laughs> um, yeah, it's a girl with a because why not? I was bored one night and I asked my boyfriend like, hey babe, what should I draw? And you should he was like, draw a girl with a So I drew a girl with a and this is how it turned out. And then one of my friends asked me why the f sketchbook and I'm like, so I wanted to draw a girl with a I didn't know what to draw and this is, this is what inspired out of it. This was actually, this little one right here, this was actually, um, Based off a guy who was like leaning um, forward on the table and he had tattoos and he had a t-shirt on and I didn't want to draw his face so I just did a scroll with a giant eyeball on it. Why the fuck not? And like city drawing um, with ice on it. Um, this is based off a picture I took, actually. Oh, the dog's barking! Ah, uh, the first Disney castle sketch. I think I did two or, th two or three of these? Maybe two. I think I only did two. So this was the first sketch I did of the Disney castle. Very time consuming to draw this. Very, very time consuming. Random sketches I did for one of my final projects. Um, I didn't end up doing some of these. Some of them I wish I would because that'd be kind of cool. That'd be kind of cool, but... Um, oh well. Yes, all the bodies. So these are um, different increment drawings. So there's 30 second sketches. So these are all done in 30 seconds. And then we go to one minute. And this was five minutes. So another five minutes. This was 10 minutes. So you can kind of see just the differences in how. 30 seconds, 10 minutes can make when you're doing figure drawings, so pretty cool. Sketches. Oh, this is some more architecture drawings that we I got from a building, so this was pretty cool. These are really random sketches. Nobody's gonna understand what these are but me. They're for future endeavors, future projects I really wanna do. I'm probably gonna do some more mock-up sketches of what I really wanna do because these are pretty sloppy. Can't really decipher between them, but I know exactly what I wanna do, so. This was some mock-ups I did for my bullet journal I did last month, um, so that's what I was- <music> Sketches I was doing for my final project for one of my classes, I was trying to figure out what kind of pose I wanted to do for my thing, which I ended up using this reference right here, um, because 
this was just a really cool pose and it was kind of like the shape and movement I wanted to do so that's that and then this was the mock-up sketch of what I was gonna do kind of so yeah that's kind of cool and I think the rest of this is just blank paper that I haven't finished using up yet but I think I'm gonna be starting a new notebook anyway because um, I really need to use these last three pages, but I might do some random sketches in it if I need to. But that is everything I drew and wrote in my notebook over the one semester. Clearly, there's a lot. And I think it's just kind of cool to like go through sketchbooks because everybody does their sketchbooks so differently. So, yeah. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Um, please like, subscribe, hit that notification bell. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you in the next video.